Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys had a blessed day. I know I did guys. Thanks for showing up. Thanks for watching. Guys, if you don't know who I am, now you do guys. My name is Justin. Smash that subscribe button below. Become part of our huge family as we grow every single day. Alright, so got another brand new drink for you guys here. So this one is actually going to be a key into several other mixed drinks that we're going to be doing. But... Today, we're going to be rocking out, just trying an old plain style pinnacle whipped. Uh, so, what you kind of may or may not know, uh, it is French vodka. It is 60 proof, 30% alcohol. And pinnacle has some of the most flavored vodkas that are on the shelf. Um, and most of the time, they have the best flavor. Uh, but, there's a few that I've tried that just weren't that great. But this is the first pinnacle that we've done on the channel, so super excited. Uh, and this is leading up to, guys, you know who he is. You've seen him before, Eddie Wall. He, this was kind of his thing. Um, he wanted me to make this into a mixed drink. We're going to be doing that as well. But I wanted to give you guys a review of the pinnacle whipped first. All right, so let's go ahead and open it up. And this is not cold. This is straight off my shelf. As you can see, there's no like water droplets or anything like that. Straight off the shelf. All right, there we go. Mm. Okay. So I can smell it. It's really sugary. Obviously, off the nose is whipped, but it doesn't smell like uh, whipped cream would normally smell. It has more of the... Uh... So if you look at it like a cake, you got whipped icing and then you got like traditional. It smells more like traditional icing. Really. All right, let's go ahead and give it a shot. It is a very clear, it's about as clear as clear can get. That's vodka for you, but hey, let's give it a shot. Hmm. Okay. So it's soft. It's almost like a marshmallow. Uh, it tasted, it tastes like a toasted marshmallow. Um, it's kind of thickening as it like does its cycle, but it doesn't taste bad. It's not too heavy. It doesn't have a strong vodka burn. It tastes, like I said, just almost identical to a marshmallow, like a, or like a, just a fluffed regular marshmallow, not, maybe not even toasted, but definitely what I'm getting from it. Not a huge whipped flavor or nothing like that. Mostly, um, probably should have called this the marshmallow flavor, but. I'm going to say that they did a really good job on this one. I've had, I've had several pinnacles that were just too much in the flavor, but I think that they've done really good on this one. It's not too heavy. It's not over dramatic. It doesn't try to outdo the whipped flavor. I mean, it's sticky. I can feel it on my lips a little bit, but at the end of the flavor and the end of the drink, it has a nice aftertaste. It has a kind of mouth drying taste to it it doesn't necessarily make you like hey i need more but um definitely a little bit drier than what you would want to drink but then again this is vodka N nobody that i know just casually sips on vodka but to be able to make this into drinks it's going to be limitless with the possibilities because of how the flavor coincides with a lot of different drinks whether it be juices maybe ice cream drinks stuff like that this could go well with a lot of things uh root beer all those like darker drinks something with rum i think this could go great with a lot of things so thank you eddie for having me buy this uh we have several others that we bought that we're trying to get out there. Um, I did have a list of drinks to go get yesterday uh, from Friday's live the day before. 
but uh, we weren't able to get all of them because our my liquor store did not have them. Uh, I'm off Tuesday. I plan on going to a different liquor store, maybe two or three, to try and find some of those more harder to find bottles for you guys. But nonetheless, I'm going to say this is a win for Pinnacle. It smells great, uh, but the taste is better than the smell by a ton and a half honestly because it's and like i said marshmallows all day but the smell is just kind of plain i think it could uh, it could have a little more on the nose well cheers mm. <sighs> like i said it's good aftertaste is there for a vodka 60 proof definitely gonna be a good mixer i think in my opinion and I'm ready to try that mixed drink that Eddie wants me to try. Not naming it because I'm going to leave it a surprise for you guys. But hey, thanks for watching. I hope you guys had a blessed Sunday. I know I did. It's great. Cannot wait for tomorrow being Miller Monday, guys, as a brand new live will come out then. And a new video as always, guys, because you know we post videos Monday through Thursday, Saturday and Sunday. We go live Monday, Wednesday, Friday, guys. You know how it works. But till later, till next time, till always, guys, smash that like button, hit the subscribe button, become part of our huge families we grow every single day. And if you use this in any type of drinks or you mix it with anything special, let me know in the comments, guys. Hit that notification bell. It lets you know when I do all my fancy things. But guys, y'all have a wonderful and blessed the rest of your Sunday. I hope you guys enjoyed this review of the Pinnacle Whipped 60 Proof French Vodka. Guys, y'all have a blessed night. And I'm Justin. You know that now. Become part of the family by that subscribe button below. And stay tuned because we post every single day. So guys, till tomorrow, when I see you from Miller Monday in a brand new video, y'all have a wonderful night. May you drink a cold drink. May you drink it with me. Y'all have a great night, guys. Catch you later.